walking up on the Goodman. I'm recording this right now as the install change out video is done. Or actually premiering right now. I just wanted to say that I found out that it doesn't have a Copeland. Well, it does. It has an Emerson Copeland scroll. And uh, this is how quiet it rounds. It's also starting to run, or rain, <laughs> starting to rain. Has really nice airflow though. And then, there's the carry comfort. I really cannot wait till winter to get defrost out of both of these now though. They're gonna be great. There's the inside of the carrier comfort. Can't really show you the inside of the Goodman though. But there's the reversing valve. I believe in the premiering video, I showed the reversing valve and how big it was. And over here is where I have the old units. I do not plan on scrapping them for a while, if I do, because I believe the condenser still works. It's just there was a leak in the evaporator coil. I can actually show you the coil right now. Hold on, let me walk around. It's also thundering, so I may come back out in a little bit and record that. But here's the blower part. I'll have to show you guys the coil later when I take the panel back off. Look at all the dirt down there. It won't focus. My camera won't focus down there. Hold on. Let's just try this. Maybe this will work. Hey, there you go. You can see how dirty it was down there. But I put this as close as I could under here so it didn't really get wet. So there are the old units. And here is the new Goodman that I can hardly even hear from here. I do plan on doing a start up and shut down um, soon. I will be out of state uh, this Sunday, the 23rd third but late that day so and it's supposed to stop sunday it's supposed to go all the way from then so hopefully i'll get a start up and shut down by then of both units all right the rain's starting to pick up so i gotta wrap up the video so here's the carrier and goodman units try and get a front view for you guys The Goodman is a two and a half ton, 14 sear Goodman heat pump. Looking forward to the defrost. It was made in um, 2019, manufactured in 2019. Overall so far, it's been cooling really great. In my room, it's been about 70 degrees and thermostat's only sat on 74, but my room's always gotten colder. So, how's that? Feels nice being cool in there though. It's starting to rain more and I didn't put my jacket on when I came out. So I may come back out later if it starts raining harder, get some better videos in the rain, because I know people like that. So, uh, see you guys next time.